guys I'm back and this is my skincare routine daytime video and I'm just gonna go through each product that I use and you can see what I do to get my clear skin so starting off when I first get up in the morning I cleanse my face with my CVS acne control cleanser and just make sure all the dirt is gone and then when I um when I take a shower, I, I usually leave this in the shower and, uh, and I use my exfoliating brush along with my deep cleansing exfoliating scrub to get all of the excess skin and dirt off. And then I have really oily skin, like it sucks hardcore. Uh, so I use a toner. Some people think toners are jokes, but I think it works, like it gets the extra dirt off and even sometimes like when I, or most of the time, when I wake up in the morning, I still have a little bit of makeup left on my eyes and, you know, on my face a little bit. And, um, so it gets that off, which is good, before it turns into acne. So, yeah, don't want that. And that is my CVS Refreshing Toner. I am, like I said in past videos, I love the drugstores, like CVS in particular, Walgreens is my second favorite. I love drugstores because they're cheaper and this works for me, so I buy a lot of CVS products. This next one's a CVS product too, and it is called the Perfect and Correct Cleansing Plus, and it's to reduce um, fine lines and wrinkles. They're just like little wipes, I usually just use one, um, but I don't use it for that. It was on sale, it's originally $7.29, but it was on sale for like $1.50 or something. And um, I just use it to get, again, that excess oil and um, makeup and dirt. And you would be surprised. It sounds like I'm doing a lot to do that. But, like, I will use this and it will come off on the pad. And I've already cleansed my face and exfoliated, so you think it would be all gone. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> There's still, dirt still comes off on this. So I can only imagine. Like, it's, it's just awful. I have such awful skin um but then i use my curel daily moisturizer fragrance free and i don't know if that matters to people but i think it's great it makes my skin extra extra soft and awesome feeling and then i don't have any products that have spf in it but i realize the importance of spf uh, so I actually have like a ton of sunscreen like I, I swear I've got like six bottles lying around or something so I literally use a bottle of sunscreen and this is the banana boat ultra defense in SPF 30 I just put a little bit of it on in the morning and this will probably last me like seven years because it's just it's such a big bottle <laughs> but and I use such so little of it but we'll see so protect the skin um, and then I use this is actually a really expensive product I don't know if I'm willing to pay the twenty two dollars it costs but I I got it on sale for like five fifty or something and it's the physician's formula um, intensive wrinkle corrector eye cream and it literally is just that it corrects your wrinkles and makes sure that it you don't have any aging and then I got this CVS Eye Brightener Roller Pen. So I, I just put this um, under my eyes and just sort of to brighten it up a little, especially in the morning because I have really bad dark circles and, you know. Speaking of dark circles, <laughs> I uh, also use this Garnier Fructis Skin Renew Anti-Dark Circle Roller in medium deep. And it actually is a two-in-one. It acts as a concealer too, but I just use it for the dark circles and then I finally move on to the um, acne cream after this whole shebang and I use proactive now I don't normally plan on using this this is just like I used used it for a little while and it didn't really work and then I, I found it so I figured I might as well use it you know and get rid of it and so once this is gone I don't think I'm gonna go back because I actually got this bun, which is the Acne Free Terminator 10 Maximum Strength, and I love it, and it's only $5 at CVS, if you have a CVS card, if not, it's $5.99, um, and unlike this, which is like $20, 
and it works so much better than the proactive so one of the extra things I do to help my skin stay better is I take some vitamins um, the first one I take is my super B complex with vitamin C and I take this for a couple reasons not just for skin but I lack in vitamin B and I also take B12 at the same time but two um, my skin tends to dry up easier and it makes my hair fall out so I take both to help with that and it it's supposed to help um, your skin and like make it healthier and um, it's supposed to make sure that you, your, your hair grows really healthy so it's just an extra precaution I think. Um, and then I take my big horse pill of vitamin C supplement and this vitamin C is just one of those vitamins that it helps with a lot of different aspects in your body other than your skin like your immune system but as far as skin goes it makes it healthy as well as helps out with your nails and hair to stay healthy so I do that and then the final one I take is my vitamin E and even though there's vitamin E in sunscreen and I use that both in the morning and at night I still take this to protect myself from um, the sun because I am one of those people that I tan very easily but the minute I'm like out in the sun a second too long I just like burn like I there's no like leading up to it or anything like that like it's just I either burn or tan really well and I just I there's not just the incident where there, I got a little color that day it's just so I I don't want to um, ruin my skin obviously so I, I take these supplements another thing I do is I give myself a facial each week it's like going to the spa but I get to stay at home and save money which is good that is always very very good so um, the first thing I do is I take my <laughs> CVS uh, blackhead clearing scrub and I just take one of these cotton rounds and I get all of the nastiness off my face and then I um, take this I think it's called Bior deep cleansing pore strips and it comes with 14 strips seven for your nose and seven for your face and I'll take one of the um, I think this is the nose one yeah and I'll just put it right here and then I take one of the face ones and I usually put it you know if I have a big pimple or something I'll put it on there and just you know let it put some water on it and let it set um, for usually about 15 minutes but it usually doesn't take that long it usually takes like five maybe ten minutes to dry but I just do it for 15 just in case and then I peel it off and it's wicked soft on my nose and it's great um, and then I put on my CVS spot treatment in case I have like just a bunch of little pimples this is just an extra precaution because I am really acne prone I wouldn't do this if I wasn't so acne prone, but I am so I do that and then I use my Alba deep sea facial mask and I put that on on and then I top it off with my cucumber melon peel off mask and I let it sit on my face um, oh this is by Freeman by the way and I let it sit on my face usually about 10 to 15 minutes and I wash it off and my pores are like are all opened up and they're night and you know nice and soft my skin meaning my skin um, and it's just it's great I, I love that's like one of my favorite parts of my week because it just it's so awesome you can just sit around your house and do a little facial a mini facial you don't have to spend a lot of money so that is my day um, skin routine and rather than make another long video about my night routine um, I'm just gonna say I do the same thing at night honestly except I add makeup remover that's the first step I do and I use my CVS eye makeup remover and then I go through the whole thing again and then I go to bed and this is how I get it <laughs>